Hi everyone, welcome to Java Express Academy. Today I'm going to explain Java 9, another feature, Stream API enhancements, couple of new methods introduced in the Java 9. I'm going to explain those methods here. As part of the Stream API, overall four methods are introduced. Take while and do while are default methods. Iterate and off nullable or static methods, okay? Default methods and static methods are introduced in the stream API enhancements here. Okay. Now, if you go to the take while method, what is the use? Hope everyone knows um, in Java 8 filter method. Filter method, if you have 10 elements, whichever condition is true, those elements will be written for you. But in case of the take while method, it will not process all the elements. There is no guarantee. It will process every element of the stream. It will not process. We don't have any guarantee until on what condition until your predicate returns true. If predicate returns true, those elements you will get. Okay. And if predicate return false, remaining all elements will be discarded here. Even if it is a valid number, it will be discarded. This is the advantage of using take while. Do while method, it is opposite of take while method. I mean to say, if any element, as long as predic uh, predicate is true, it will drop the element. Whenever if you see predicate is false, wherever the condition is failed, rest of the stream will be written. That is the do while method. Okay, now we have a iterate method in Java 8 iterate. It will take only two arguments. The main purpose of iterate method is to prevent infinite loops. Okay, in Java 9, we have another version called iterate with three argument constructor. Previously, it has a two argument constructor in Java 9. It is a three argument constructor here. Now, another method is off nullable. It is introduced to avoid null pointer exception here from Java 9 onwards. Inside a stream, if you have a null value, basically it method returns a empty stream if stream is null here. It can also be used for the non-empty stream as well. Basically, before we will have a null pointer from now onwards, there is no null pointer exception. You will get as a empty stream. These are the four methods are available in Java 9 here, guys. Okay, let me create a couple of examples so that you will get some best option. Okay, uh, this is factory methods. Let me create a fresh project here, Java project. 04, okay, uh, stream and stream API, stream API methods. Okay, Java 9 feature. Let me create the project. Quickly, uh, let me create a class for you. Okay, uh, stream take while demo. Okay, now here, let me create a main method. Now, let me uh, take a couple of values. Uh, let me grab it for you guys. So, these are the values I have. So, I have a uh, five values. Uh, uh, I'm converting to a numbers during arrays dot list. Here, I want to apply our logics here. See here. First, we'll go for the filter method and then we'll discuss about the take while method. Okay. Inside a stream, I want to write a condition. Okay. Number. What is my condition? Number modulo double equals to true. If condition is true, I want to collect collectors. Hope oh, this is a well known method collectors dot to list here. Okay. Now you will get your result. Now what I can do system dot out dot print ln. Let me print some even numbers. Okay. Here I want to print my result here. Just have a look difference. Right click Java application. See two, four, six, eight, ten. That is the filter method logic. Now, instead of the filter method, what I will do? I will do take while method. Then have a look. Result one, instead of the filter, take while method. What it will do? Whichever predicate is true, first condition succeeded, succeeded, succeeded. Here the condition is filled. All these elements will be discarded. Now see, run as Java application, 246. If you use do while, what will happen? These are all will be discarded. 
these elements will be written i will look here what i will do let me take stream drop file it is a opposite of take well here what i will do let me remove this whole part let me choose the drop file now here the condition is true condition is true condition here condition is failed so all these elements return back if you use a take well these elements you will get these elements will be discarded if you are using drop well these elements will be discarded and these elements will be returned now run as java application see 157899 this is the use of the drop file method and we have a iterate method as well right let me create a new class stream iterate <clears throat> iterate demo now previously how we have a logic inside a stream class we have a called iterate method inside a iterate method we have a condition two arguments what is the increment number and i want to add some couple of elements this is the one how to display the data by using system dot out print ln method <clears throat> print ln method now what will happen it will be generate infinite loop of numbers see here see numbers it will be keep on generating for you infinite loop now to avoid this condition we have a method called a limit method i want to display only 10 elements then how i can use here we have a limit method by using these only it will generate random number maybe you can start with 100 okay now only 10 elements will be printed now see run as java application no okay let me comment it this one else it will be keep on generating right click run as java application see 10 elements is displayed instead of using this limit method as well you can provide a condition here okay by using three argument constructor this is the one now first which element you want 100 now for this element i want to print okay uh, x less than 100 okay here you can provide another condition by using okay uh, less than 90 see okay or okay now uh, here i want to add a condition okay what i here what is the condition okay let me print my data as well here then you will get some best option see here <clears throat> here what is my condition x less than 100 now have a look this output see okay if i use a greater than greater than 100 okay here i can provide another condition as well less than 90 now no here basically it's a increment operation cannot convert boolean to an integer it is saying so it's a increment operation it's come providing your condition suppose a given one okay here let me give to eight some condition for each element i want to append some uh, some logic you want to do here now see this is a three argument constructor here okay let me comment it this one then you will get output see one comma six something it should be less than eight here you are incrementing by one one plus one how much six sorry uh what is the first element one it is printing and a six less than eight it is printing something here whatever you want you can add it here so no issue at all right click run as java application only one is printing okay hope you are clear this one and uh, we have another method called nullable it's a, a simple topic let me go ahead and create uh, new class sorry delete it mm. okay stream nullable okay let me delete everything now see here inside a stream we have a one method called nullable static method if you pass as a null here basically previously you will get as a null pointer exception here 
maybe you can use written type as a stream is a generic if you are trying to print your data see for each uh, str system dot out println method of your string just i want to print your okay i should not use method reference here dot right click run as okay it's not a stream sorry it's a string run as java application see nothing will be printed on the console this is for the null now if you if you have some value to here something like as a spring boot if you have it now stream let me change variable name one and one here okay it's a str only so this is a stream one i want to apply here if you want to know whether it is printing or not empty see run as our application see spring boot is printing why because whenever it is a null it will give a empty string when you are doing an empty string even it will not go to inside this condition itself i mean while printing it will not go it's a empty stream here this is a new uh, concept in uh, java 9 version it is introduced here see since java 9 it is introduced hope you guys are clear about stream api methods we'll see uh, new features in the next session thank you